Hi everyone. If you are like me, you are constantly trying to find new ways to engage your students virtually. And to be honest, it's a crisis. But I have found a couple of ways that have been working for me in the classroom. So I just wanted to share those with you. Um, the first one we all know very well is our bell friend. So in the beginning, I would use this bell just as we were learning classroom expectations, right? You hear the bell, make sure everybody's on mute. Um, and we still do that with different math games and stuff. But the main purpose I use this bell is to light my students up. So when I have students that give really good answers, they're participating, they're just on fire, we turn up with this bell. So when they hear this bell go off like that, my kids, they know to kind of raise the roof. They put their hands up like that. So it's our way of kind of building community in the classroom too. Everybody loves to be cheered for, even as adults. And so it's the way of, it's my way of kind of making everybody feel like, oh wow, they're cheering for me. And when it's their turn, they want the whole class to turn up with them too. So this bell has been an amazing addition into our classroom. And I know some of my, some of my parents might be like, if Ms. Shermel rings that bell one more time, but uh, we turn up with this bell and at least parents will know, even though this bell goes off all day long, at least they know magic is happening in the classroom every time they hear the bell. Uh, my second one is, let's talk about this mute button, okay? Um, make sure you're on mute. We can't hear you. You're on mute. Wait, let me mute. Who is that? That's still, it's, it's, it's a lot, right? So I spend a lot of my day with the whole mute situation, right? So today we found a way um, to kind of, in a fun way, get everybody on mute, right? And I'm a big um, dance, singer, think of a theme, a chant type of teacher, I guess. So today I kind of started, toot toot, everybody on mute. Toot toot, everybody on mute. Hey, toot toot, everybody on mute and it worked. Like as soon as I did the toot toot, everybody on mute, of course everybody hit their mute button and then they were, I couldn't hear a word they were saying because they were on mute, but I did see everybody doing the hand motions. And again, it's the small things in virtual learning that really make a huge difference. So those are just two little things that I have been finding to be useful um, for my classroom. That is all. I just wanted to share those two things with you. Thanks guys.